Hi, my name is Farouk Tuncha. I graduated in 2016 MPP and I'm CEO and co-founder of Politea. We provide data-empowered governance solutions for city leaders. Actually, my story starts in Moabit. This is not far from here. You might have lived there during your uh, time here at Hati. And now it's a very fancy neighborhood, a lot of cafes, a lot of families. But back in the days, it was, it was a tough neighborhood. So it was basically famous for two things. It's jail and failing students. And when I was a student, 2016, 2006, uh, we had a Berlin-wide reform. And you know, when you grow up there, you think, okay, this is, this is something you're detached to. But in Berlin, they introduced a mandatory test, so to pass to the A-level for the first time ever, after the PISA studies showed that Germany is not in that best shape in the education system. And 85% of my class dropped out in that year. And this, in that year, was not very an, an event to me. But when I did my A-level, I was starting to think, why did that happen? Why did they drop out? Why did they have to? What is, what is with them? What are they doing now? I uh, haven't met a lot of them after that. And so I thought deeply about the school system and yeah, began my interest in public policy. And after thinking about schools, I studied education, dived deep into the topic and uh, empirical research just to realize that schools like kindergartens, like police stations, fire departments, are part of a big, bigger system, a very complex system, cities. And I focused more on the layer, urban policy in general. Here at Hattie, I did a lot of papers on that. I wrote my master thesis about smart cities, how technology can help to make city services better, so to improve citizens' lives. After graduating, I, I met a woman. <laughs> <laughs> you might know her. <laughs> and I got the offer for the city to do their urban policy and as in the strategy department. I, I took that offer and I did that one and a half years in, in this building actually. And writing speeches, writing policy papers as typical, but mostly what I really took from that was the network. So met a lot of mayors, high level representatives of municipal associations. I enjoyed that, but still, it was far away from what I left, cities. It was far away, federal level, local level, that's, that's a big gap. And I wanted to do something more groundwork, more close to the city, so I had basically two options, work for a city or do some business with cities. And I did business with cities. So I stumbled basically, incidentally, into an investor. He did a FinTech two years ago, an exit, made some money and was looking for someone from the policy field to push a venture that is making cities' decision-making better. And I took that opportunity in January, joined Politea as CEO and co-founder. We have three people now working here in Berlin, uh, mostly with cities around Berlin to test with them. And we, in that talks with the cities, we realized there's a big problem in Germany. You have a lot of data. So cities collect a lot of data about themselves. But this data is locked in silos, so it's not connected, it's not available for their decision making. And that's what we want to do. We want to connect the data on a platform and basically provide a governance platform for mayors, treasurers, heads of administrations. Just to give an example, this is how a main screen looks for childcare education. We integrate population data from the registry, we integrate budget data from the budget software, and uh, the HR software, and then, for example, depict how the population of certain age groups evolved over time, how they might evolve in the next two years, show the capacity, will it reach a certain threshold, will it be over oversized, for example, do I have to act, will it be expensive, do I have to extend the budget, all automatically at your fingertip as a mayor. Yeah, this is what we do now. We do it together with the city, so we go there and uh, develop together with them. It's a nice challenge and yeah, that's what I'm doing now and I'm looking forward to discuss with you and answer your questions. Thanks.